Osseo integration is the process of attaching an external prosthesis directly to the skeleton. It's uniquely suited for patients with military style or combat related amputations because they often have difficulty with traditional socket based prostheses. Some amputees function very highly in a socket based prosthesis in terms of running marathons, triathlons, competing in Paralympic or even regular Olympic sports. But a number of amputees struggle with their sockets and uh, you know we have new designs, new plastics, carbon fiber, all of these things that have the potential to make sockets somewhat better but at its core base socket technology hasn't changed in the last decades or, or even more than a century in some respects. This is, this is not just a surgical procedure. This is a procedure that requires buy-in from orthopedic surgeons, plastic surgeons, rehabilitation physicians, prosthetists, therapists, so, we, uh, so patients can uh, uh, get the best possible outcome. I think in an appropriately counseled and selected patient, um, this is a really great and exciting alternative. Well, I had been investigating having it done on my leg with someone I had met through the VA system and he said you should have your arm done first and I said with all due respect sir nobody's doing arms yet and he said that's because it's just about to be done do you want to be first and I said absolutely and I got on the list and here I am. The mission of the Department of Defense Osseo Integration Program is to uh, develop the capability of osseo integration within the Department of Defense. The first step is to gain experience in screening, operating on patients, and performing the rehabilitation, and then training other providers from other centers to be familiar with the technique. So when these patients have complications, and some of them will, they'll be able to be cared for closer to home.